will be a bit cooler. As we mentioned at the top of the newscast, we have our 10th name storm of the season. Tropical Storm Julia does look like new thunderstorm development around the center is indicating that it is trying to get a little bit better organized and perhaps will start strengthening. That is the official forecast briefly becoming a hurricane before landfall in Nicaragua and then continuing through Honduras and the rest of Central America. There is the question as to what happens to its remnants as we get into early next week as some of the models try and indicate this little remnant of uh, uh, Julia as it is over Central America starts moving around the periphery of this upper high and being drawn into the Bay of Campeche or maybe even the Gulf. Note the upper trough that'll be deepening as we head toward late next week as well. That would help to kind of draw that disturbance or the moisture into the Gulf. Well, here's what would possibly happen if it were to get into the Gulf. Right now, it looks like it would be drawn northward, maybe toward the Louisiana coast, as rainfall and much needed rainfall. Keep in mind, at this time late next week, we'll have dry air kind of mixing in with that upper trough and very strong upper level winds, which create wind shear. This does not look like if the remnants were to get into the Gulf that it would try and develop into anything. If anything does happen, it would likely just be drawn moisture from that system, then pushed away from us as the cold front moves on through. So there are some models that are indicating maybe what is left of it moving into the Gulf, but it would not be as a storm or a depression or an organized system at all. The Gulf of Mexico at that time would be too hostile, and by the end of next week, we'll have another cold front moving on through, which would then push all of that away from us. So maybe we tap into the moisture and we could use it, and it does look like our rain chances will be increasing ahead of that next front, which moves through by next Friday. This weekend, looking gorgeous.